of course I hate these people. And let's all hate these people because maybe hate is what we need if we're going to get something done. I mean, it's incredible. After that terrible attack in Central Park, you spent a lot of money taking ads that seemed, Donald, to the casual reader, insightful, like vigilante, wow, let's fight back. You want to give me a little history? Well, I, I mean, I don't see anything insightful. I am strongly in favor of the death penalty. I'm also in favor of bringing back police forces that can do something instead of just turning their back because every quality lawyer that represents people that are in trouble, so the first thing they do is start shouting uh, police brutality, etc. The disappointing aspect of it is that while 95% of the people agree with me, probably 40% of the columnists agree. I mean, I've had newspaper people, in fact, I had some woman the other day stick a microphone in my face from one of the major networks, but don't you have compassion for these young men that raped and beat and mugged and everything else, this wonderful woman? I had a case the other day, I went to a hospital in Brooklyn a woman was raped, mugged, and thrown off a four-story building, okay? And a reporter asked me whether or not I had any compassion or feeling for the people that did it. Do I have hatred for them? And I said, look, this woman was raped, mugged, and thrown off a building. Thrown off a building on top of everything else. She's virtually, I mean, she's got some major problems, to put it mildly. I said, of course I hate these people, and let's all hate these people, because maybe hate is what we need if we're going to get something done. I mean, it's incredible when a, a reporter asks well, me whether or not I have compassion for the people that did this crime. Uh, I have absolutely it, no compassion. Uh, obviously. How about if it were asked this way? We don't know who did that crime, and the court's going to decide who did that crime. Were you prejudging those arrested? No, I'm not prejudging at all. I'm, I'm not in this particular case. I'm saying if they're found guilty, if the woman died, which she hopefully will not be dying, but if the woman died, I think they should be executed. I think they, you should have the death penalty. I think most people agree with me on that. Was the ad careful to say if? Because there could have been a bystander. Well, there could they have been can, someone you wrongfully can, you can write arrested. Anything. I mean, here's a fairly long ad. It was fairly detailed and all, and you can take any interpretation. The problem with our society is that the victim has absolutely no rights and the criminal has unbelievable rights. Unbelievable rights. And I say it has to stop. That's why I took the ad. And I have to tell you, that ad, I've never done anything that's been so positively received.